Hello, welcome back to my channel. We are gonna do my boxy Lux for December. Um, this came sometime last week and I just haven't had a chance to film. Um, I did open it and go through it because I forgot that I was gonna actually film this video. I haven't been filming much, so I forgot, but we're gonna open this. This one, they've raised their prices, so I feel like it's $60 now for boxy Lux. Um, so it's an upgrade from the base box, which I think is now like 26. I don't know. They've, they've raised their prices for BoxyCharm. I do have a referral link down. I'll leave it down below. Um, BoxyLex is hard because it's ginormous. Um, I did save the card, thankfully, but I'm going to say that my box is not super exciting. Um, I'm not upset about any of the products that are in here, but it's not necessarily maybe the most exciting box. Um, let's start off with the item that I picked because you do get to choose. Well, you get to choose two items for Boxy Lux. Um, the second choice, there wasn't a lot to pick from, so I'm not necessarily super excited about the second choice, but the first thing that I was able to pick is the ABH Dip Brow pomade. Um, I've never used this. The only pomades that I've used is the Ulta brand one and then um, Benefits. Um, it comes in a little pot and then you do get the ABH brow brush with it which I did have to repurchase um, my favorite eyebrow brush from the brow gal but so I'm excited to have a second like really good brow brush. Um, so this retails for it says $39, so I think that's the brush and the pomade. I don't remember what this is by itself. It's an expensive pomade, which is why I've never tried it. But So that was, I think the other item that I picked was this. This is a, um, it's for your hair, multi-benefit treatment. Um, it adds shine, softness, detangling says it controls frizz, acts like, like a leave-in conditioning, um, moisturizes, and it's also a heat protectant. So there's this, I will use it. It's just not a super like exciting product. Um, this says it retails for $36, which is expensive, but like I said, I will use it, especially because it's a heat protectant. Um, the next thing is the Essential Radiance Vitamin C um, Intensive Face Cream by Kat Berkey, I think. I don't, I've never heard of this brand. This says it retails for $116. And like, you think like with a box this size that it's this gigantic jar, this is all the bigger it is. I mean, it's not a bad size, but considering the size of the box, like there's a lot of ways to carve her, but that's an expensive face cream. I do like vitamin C and it is something that I will use. I have a lot of skincare um, that I've gotten from boxes in my bathroom and I try and just open what I'm using. So this is something that I will get to. Um, and then I got Aceology. It's a detoxifying treatment mask. It says it detoxifies, purifies, and regenerates. Um... This is a peel off. It is a peel off. Um, I like using peel off masks like in this area. I'll do a little bit here and here and you don't have to peel them off. Um, peeling masks can actually be very like damaging to the collagen, um, but you can use water and just wash them off. You don't have to peel them. Generally, if I am gonna peel them, I usually only do around my nose because I get really bad like not really bad, but that's where I'm, like most of my clogged pores are. But just so you know, if you're like peeling from like your whole face, just be very, very careful um, because they're not great for your skin. But like I said, you don't have to peel them off. You can just wash them off. But there's that. Um, I'm actually excited about this. This is from Pharmacy. I do like that brand. This is the Honeymoon Glow Body, which normally... I wouldn't necessarily be excited about a body care item, but this is a resurfacing serum. 
since I've had the baby, I've had um, like my arms, like the top half of my arms have broken out. Like it's acne, but like the bumps like itch almost. I think it's, you know, just my body's purging, you know, extra hormones and stuff from being pregnant and having the baby. But it's annoying because my arms haven't broken out in years. Um, so this actually says that it can help eliminate bumps, rough skin, help soften. So I thought that I could give this a try and like might help my arm situation. Oh, I forgot to say this retails for $69, which is expensive. How big is this too? I didn't even look and then we'll go back to the, yeah, that's expensive. <laughs> How many ounces? It's 2.19 ounces, but, and you only use a little bit, but that's an expensive, almost $70 face mask. And then this retails for 40. Like I said, normally I wouldn't be excited about something like this for your body, but I do have a need for it. So hopefully that will work. And then the last thing, oh no, that's not the last thing. There's a couple more things. Um, this is from Persona. This is just an eyeliner. I thought this was a liquid liner, um, and I wasn't going to open it, and then I realized it's just a, it's just a pencil liner. It's waterproof in black, which I like a good black liner. It looks like a creamy formula. Looks, it reminds me of like Pixies. It's very, very creamy. So, um, this will go in my drawer. It came in this like little like weird packaging but this retails for 14 but I am obsessed this is one of I did a video on like makeup related items that I can't stop buying and eyeliners is one of them so I'm happy to have that especially because it's waterproof um so I think most of my pencil liners that are waterproof are like minis that I got from my Sephora play box forever ago so I'm excited I'm happy to have that and then there's a mascara. I'm going to keep this in the box because I won't open it until I need it. This is from Pure, fully charged. I don't know if I've ever tried a Pure mascara. I don't remember. Um, it's an age defying, which I don't know why you need age defying like mascara. It says it's magnetically charged. It's supposed to help keep your lashes curled and lifted and separated and all that. It retails for $22. Again, I just hold on to the mascaras and I have a backup like container. And so when I need them, I pull them out. So I'll use that eventually. And then the last thing is a brush set from, I think it's Larisse. And this retails for $50. Now it's nice, I do like this case. It's like a plastic, like you can use this for travel. And I do go like to Montana to visit my grandma. Um, I think I opened that upside down. So I, I'm gonna keep the case. I'm excited to have that like for brushes for traveling. Um, my makeup bag that I have does have a slot for brushes, but then everything's all shoved in the bag. So I do like the container, but again, $50 or five brushes. They're, they're all nice. I'm going to use them all, um, but like that just seems pricey. The handles are nice. Um, they're textured. This one, I'm trying to think how I would use this because it doesn't really matter what it says it's for. I think for me it would be like setting and then something like this, potentially for a highlighter, maybe. I don't, like for me, I think it would just mainly be for powder. Um, there's an angle brush for like something like this, like blush. It's small enough for my face, like contour. And then there's three eye brushes, which are all nice. They're smaller because I have small eyes. I hate when you get like eye brushes and sets and they're gigantic. I mean, some people do need them, but for me, I can't use them if they're too big. So there's just a flat brush, which is good. A little blending brush. And again, this is a nice size, I think for anybody, but like for me, I can actually use it in my crease. 
And then I like these kinds of like smudger brushes um, for under the lash line. But for $50, it just seems pricey for what it is. But like I said, I am happy to have the brushes in the case. I will use them. So yeah, that is everything that I got in my Boxylux. Um, let me know what you guys got. Hopefully it won't be too long before I film another video. But yeah, thank you guys so, so much for watching. And hopefully I will see you in another video very, very soon. Bye, everybody.